Hello there, I am Giant Grotto with more Pokemon Emerald. In the last part, we got the Devon Scope to see the Kecleons. We battled May, we battled our trainers. We saw Stephen Stone again, he gave us the Devon Scope. And now, we already cleared the pathway of this Kecleon. Kecleon was here, but now it's not because we used the Devon Scope and I just fled. So, I'm here to take on the gym today. And I have Knight up front, so let's get to it. Now, I think this... Puzzles slightly different than one would be in Sapphire and Emerald, and I haven't practiced it yet, so I just have to go with the flow. Yo, how's it going, Champion Bound Grotto? Fortune Gym Leader Wyona is a master of flying type Pokemon. She's waiting at the back of this gym, but behind the rotating doors. She's waiting for new challengers who are trying to take wing. Okay, go for it. Yep, yeah, Fortune City Pokemon Gym, okay. So. Like, obviously the first one, you take this one, go down, and then you go over. There we go, nice. So the same here, we go down, and then over. When Moni takes to battle, her face shines with beauty, with beautiful determination. I'm not letting you you witness that lovely sight. Do you have like a crush on or something? You creep. I'm just kidding. <laughs> Birdkeeper Herberto. Humberto. Okay, it's a Skarmory. Ay ay ay, we have to deal with a Skarmory. A Blaine's part fi half fighting type, so. We'll see how this goes. Air cutter, ouch. You gotta be kidding me. You gotta be kidding me, man. It's not cool. Today's hyper potion. Thank you for using Swift. Oh, you thought, yeah. Flamethrower. Let's just hope we can take down the Skarmory. One hit point, it looks like. Come on. Whatever. Just use double kick. No, no, no. No, okay, good. It didn't faint me. That's good. Yeah, I wasn't really expecting you to have a scar on me, so that caught me off guard. Thanks for the $9.60, though. Okay, I'm gonna take on this double battle. Uh, Knight, and... Let's do Speedy. Okay. Let's do this. Double battle time. Behold the elegant battle style of bird Pokemon. Why don't you me personally? You can't beat me easily. But you can. <laughs> okay, so Bird Keeper and Picnicker. Jared and Ashley. Six Pokemon, three each. My goodness. Um, let's go for the takedown on the Swap blue, and then let's go for the Thunderbolt on the di the duo. Ha! The do duo fainted. No, not Skarmory! Are you kidding me? Okay, safeguard so it can't prevent status. Infliction like burn or paralysis, or burn par paralysis, poison, sleep, all that good stuff. That's okay though. Headbutt on the Swabu and Thunderbolt on the Skarmory. So close. Another Swabu, huh? I'm just gonna go for the Jody with its speed. And I'm gonna try the takedown again on the Swabu. Or on this Swabu at least. And then. Oh, my normal time moves won't be very effective on Skarmory, so I'll just go for that Thunderbolt. Of course, you're gonna use Sand Attack. It still hits. Nice Thunderbolt, still hits. There we go.
Shop, yes, huh? Astonish, huh? Okay. Let's go for the headbutt on Swablu. And let's go for the strength on the Tropius. There we go. Nice. One more. Okay, these last two Pokemon are right. Okay, you have three Swablus. Are you kidding me? That's kind of tedious. No, it's going to make it easier to hit us now. <laughs> I guess you could say that. Take down on the Swablu. This is kind of getting old, you know? And the strength of the Tropius. This is going to be in a long while. It's going to be a long battle, man. Good thing takedown hits all three times, basically. Okay, I think I can still do this. Just headbutt on the Swapu and let's heal speedy um, sleep, I guess you could say. That's all she wrote, it should be. There we go. You, you, you're strong. I was beaten. Thanks for the twelve dollars and ninety-six cents, guys. I really appreciate it. Oh joy, I don't know how to do this one. I think I can figure it out though. By the looks of it, I don't know. Okay, shrooms is not fit for this gym because it's four times with defined time moves. Oh no, I don't want to put Blaine up front either because you know it's fine time moves. I'll put um. Climb up to the front, I guess. Yeah, do that. Okay, that looks really great. Okay, um... Okay, so... No. We have to go that way, don't I? See, that wasn't too hard. I'm, I'm doubting myself right here. I'm plenty good enough for you. Sorry, I skipped through a fresh part of your dialogue. The lovers of Bird Pokemon aspired to join this gym. As a member of Fortune Gym, I will not be, I will not allowed, I'm not allowed to lose. Bird Keeper and a Picnicker, but some of the Picnickers have died. But this is a camper, dude. Yeah, camper Flint. Two Pokemon each, okay? Okay, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna use Thunderbolt on the Doduo and Ice Beam on the Swallow. It's got, this one goes for the quick attack, a critical hit, ouch. Uh, Speedy uses the Thunderbolt and hopefully this defends the uh, Dodo well. Yep, there it goes. And then, Prime should go for the Ice Beam soon. Pelipper, huh? Nice. The Ice Beam hits. Let's see how much this does on the Swallow. It does a little bit over half. Okay, so Thunderbolt on the Pelipper and choose Water Gun on the Swell. Swell goes for the Wing Attack. It's a decent chunk, I guess. Let's hope this Pelipper goes down with the Thunderbolt. The Thunderbolt hits, and there we go. Nice. Oh, come on. Dang it. Okay, let's go for the Facade and the... Uh, roll up. One more Pokemon left. Axum. That's a new one. too much of a loud it was too much of a load for me to bear thanks for the $13.92 guys okay I'm gonna use this one I'm gonna try to put Blaine up to the front and see how he does I'm gonna use a soda pop Oh, 
I'll do this one, okay, I better keep your time. Hopefully you have a scar because I have a my fire type of friend. You better know that there are sorts of fine, all sorts of fine type Pokemon. You did know that, right? You do know that, right? Ah, uh, Tropius is okay. Because it's also weak to fire, I guess. Okay, um... Woke up is his attack and defense stat, but not special attack, so I won't go for that yet. So, I'll go for the overheat. Let's see how much this does. 1k, that was it nice. But the minus special attack, how she falls. But that's okay, the battle's over with now. You seem to know your stuff. Thanks, the wings for the $9.60 man. Mm. Like, how can you do this? I don't know. Okay, there we go. There we go, nice. So here's why I own the gym leader. And yeah, let's heal up. Dang it, okay. This should do it. Okay. So I'm gonna lead off with who again? Um, I'll lead off with Speedy. Okay, sounds cool. Sucker, I am one of I am the gym leader of Fortune uh, Pokemon Gym. I am I have become one with Bird Pokemon and have sword the skies. However, grueling the battle, we have triumphed with grace. Witness the elegant choreography of Bird Pokemon and I. Okay, so Bion is a 6 gym leader of Helen. She is the user of flying type Pokemon, obviously. And yeah, she starts with a swap blue. Nice. Okay. I think I can find this with a Thunderbolt, so let me just try it. So the swap blue is like way easier than when she started with a Swallow back in, uh. Dang it. Back in. Ruby, Sapphire, or Ruby and Sapphire, she started with the Swallow, which was more annoying, so keep that in mind. Let's go for the Strength. There we go, nice. And Pokemon down. Tropius, okay, so I'm gonna go to... I'm gonna go to Blaine for this one, because I can just use Overheat, I guess. Overheat that thing. No, it missed. It missed. Oh no! Oh no! No. Okay. Okay. Sunny day. That will that will raise my overheat. So that's a good thing. So I'm gonna try overheat one more time. If that misses, I'll go with the flamethrower. Sounds like a plan, guys. Oh no! 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 No. Okay. Good. That did a lot less than I expected it to be. There we go. Special attack always we fell. Dang it. Okay, well, I'll probably switch out and hopefully it gets it back, you know, it restores its stats. Okay, no, you're actually smart, you want to use your Skarmory now. Okay. I'm gonna, I'm gonna try to flamethrower on this thing. So let's go for that. Yes, flamethrower hits, and it should do at least half. I'm hoping. Okay, good, a little bit over half. Okay. I'm gonna go for another flamethrower and hopefully it doesn't heal. Hopefully Wyoming doesn't heal or scar me. Good she didn't. Nice. I'm sorry for the beeping guys, I mean that's what happens when you're in red health. Helper, okay. Let's switch to let's switch back to Speedy. Because Speedy has Thunderbolt.
Sunlight is strong still, nice. Let's go for the Thunderbolt. Okay, I went for the Protect. Fair enough, fair enough. How many Thunderbolts do I have left? Eight, okay, I'm still, I'm still in good shape. So for this the Thunderbolt will like do a massive amount of damage, if not just faint it. Because four times with the electric critical hit, thanks. Nice. Here we go. Last her Altaria, okay. For Altaria, I really recommend you use Ice Beam, TM13 Ice Beam, and teach it to one of your Pokemon, as I said before, because it'll really help. Because Altaria is four times weak to Ice type Pokemon, because it's Dragon and Flying. So, yeah. I don't think I'll one shot it with one Ice Beam, though, so I want to just weaken it down with a Bubble Beam first. That's my plan. So, you gotta go for the Dragon Dance, raising up its special attack, I think, or attack and speed. There we go. Don't want Altaria to build up all those Dragon Dances because it will hurt you later on because it'll be powerhouse and they'll sweep through your team. Let's go for one more Bubble Beam. So yeah, okay. See, so yeah, like it's raising its speed and its attack, so be aware of that. Be like on your guard and stuff, so. You know. Bubble Beam that thing off its feet. Okay, so I think I can go for an Ice Beam now that I get a little bit of health out of it. I'm quicker than apparently. So hopefully this will faint it. I got too far ahead of myself, but I just didn't. Okay, fine. I know it's gonna heal, so I'm gonna just use another ice beam. And then I hope it'll do a little bit less than half, or more than half. Okay, so it's just very chance this whole thing. A one berry. Just enough. Okay, so let's use ice beam on it. It's gonna go for the earthquake. It really covers its weaknesses, because it does have earthquake. So if you're using like a electric type Pokemon on it, on it be very careful. But it looks like that's all she wrote. So yeah, it's as easy as I guess. I'm good level 35. Nice. I defeated the leader of my own, uh... Never before have I seen a trainer command Pokemon with, such, with more grace than I. I rec in, recon in recognition of your pro of your pr prowess, prowess, I present you this- I, pre I present to you this gym badge. Thanks for your $33. Go to receive the feather badge from Wyona. Yeah, level Pokemon up to level 70 will be me. And you'll also be able to use the HM move out to fly outside battle. And this, this is a gift from me, Team 40, which is Aerial Ace. I don't know if I'm gonna teach this any of my Pokemon, but I'll see. It's speed. No Pokemon should have be able no Pokemon should be able to avoid it. Thanks, we are just doing that Pokemon up, nice. So we jump across here, jump across here, jump across here. You did it, you achieved liftoff. As we read the sign right here. Fortress your Pokemon Gym, we know Craft by Trainer's Grottle. So I'm gonna see who can win. Um Ariel, it's just out of curiosity. I know Peter can, but I've already found his, his final moveset already. Okay, I'll think about that. I don't care if this is my final moveset or not. Yep, there we go. So yeah, this has been on my Pokemon and we'll walk to get part. In the next part, we'll take on the route past the bridge that we saw when we battled that Kecleon with the Devon's Cup, I guess. So this has been John Go again. I like the watching again. Goodbye, and hope to see you guys in the next part of my Pokemon Emerald Walkthrough Guide.